look that's done. And then this one, my favourite one. Mm. Yeah. And that one. Hope you all had a really good weekend. It's chocolate down with liquid sunshine outside. There you go. <laughs> Why people move down to Cornwall after a summer holiday, they stay a year and they move back to where they came from. Good. Which is a good thing. Okay. We like holiday makers in Cornwall. We love them. The ones that go other places, all right? They're the ones that we want, the ones that go other places. Cornwall's closed this year, unless you want to go on a standpoint and drink your water, okay? All right. And it is recorded, and I hope it goes viral. Feet, alongside the beam, the beam, as if the honour beam, guys, don't rush in and get your beam. Nice little railway tracks, okay? And just get them coming up. So imagine your beam's there, and it's like a beam fit warp, if you like. Rolling the feet forwards. There, and to the rear. Curl the toes upwards. Oh, 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 you keep going that one. And I'll click in. I think this is Viv. Scratch my leg. Yeah, good. And hands up to here, guys. Push out to the rear. This will confuse her. Here we go. So keep that going, guys. Feet alongside the beam. Keep going up and double your position. Did that confuse you, Viv? Are you thinking I'll pretend I've got mine here? <laughs> it's it's no it's no beam. Long, long arms, guys. The feet are just hip, are width apart, as if the beam's between your feet. If that's all we're doing. Okay, good. Three, two, one. A nice little pause and stop there. That's enough of that one, guys. Bring the hands to here. Bring the feet down to semi sumo, and just take it around, left and right. Feel the spinal column waking up. If it's already awake and you've been doing stuff, then it's getting a rotation. I bet you do weren't doing the rotations. Left. And right, round we go, round we go. Back here, pause, hold, turn up, breathe in. Exhale again, and before we go any further, if you have, you were all in Saturday morning, so the, the tits was Saturday morning, you all seen it, and I went through the first part of when I told you about a card bend, the mechanics of picking things up and everything. It struck a chord with two or three people, Nordic walkers and people here, because they know people, some quite close to them, and they can't, they now can't get down and pick stuff up off the floor, guys. All right, so it's all this, we all know people that are these, we can pass information on and get things started, can't we? Okay, from there, let's just start transferring the body weight, left and right, get those arms swinging. So we're bringing the heart rate up. Although we're going to do some Pilates stroke stretch type moves, I want to put those in between the stuff where we take the heart rate up. There, there we go. Good, how are we going to take the heart rate up? I'm going to run in every so often and just scream boo and pull a horrible face. You always pull a horrible face, all the sessions took. Okay, I'll just scream then. Let's get the hands coming up and out. Now transfer it all, now take a visible step. So you're taking it over and drive that knee upwards, guys. Get the arms going there, left and right. Good. Don't do this on your, in your disco dance floor, Viv. You'll punch people, all right? It's not enough room. <laughs> left and right. There we go. Good. But Viv turns her camera the other way. She's got a glitter ball on the ceiling. Yes. Round we go there. Left and right. Three, two, and a one. Pause and hold. Let's bring your hands down to the side. Any side you want to, left or right. Start with that. Yes, sir. Feel a stretch of noise. So we start as we have to slow it down for mobilizations. Feel a stretch of noise. Bring it back up. That's about eight seconds on the side. And if quite a few people, guys, because we've got the six o'clock time on Thursday and Friday, a big thank you from me because you're seeing what you can get done to adjust your F word of fitness, bring that back up to accommodate that six or six o'clock time. That's good. So keep that feedback coming to me. If I have to change times of classes for the majority to be live, that's what I'll do because they're your classes and I just do as I'm told. All right. All right. Up to here, guys. Again, just slowly this time around left and right. I've noticed some, I get into some positions with the hands and people are just, I haven't even said what's happening and people start spinning around like little whirly tops all over the place. Three, two, one, pause, hold, three breaths, turn up and go. Exhale, not miss much carry, just a little bit of a warm, a beam type thing and back out again. So squish it back, turn up, go. Exhale down to the heart, pushing that out. So this one, reach for the wall to the other side. Oh, the shoulders and the, the body saying it's Monday morning. Can we just, we thought it was milk, we thought it was gent. No, it's not all the way. Turn the hands up. Hand span, open the fingers from the thumb and rotate to the rear. Rotate, so we slowed it down, but we're still taking the bar up, working hard. Big breath in. 
Exhale again, so you know what's coming next. Elbows high, three second isometric push in. Go, one, two, three. Hook the hands over and chest pull. Go, one, and two, and a three. Arc it nicely down, lock the thumb out, rotate the shoulders to the front, and then to the rear. Feeling good, guys. Hands to the hips, circle the hips around. Keep the feet wherever, wherever you feel. If you think, oh, I get a bit more out of this on the feet, bit a bit more separate, a bit narrow this morning, or I know if I bring my feet together, I'll look central the back and that's a bit tight. You just that yourself, take it back around the other way. And around the other way. Good, three, two, one, pause, hold. Pelvic tilt front and rear. There, squeeze the glutes. Slow it down, find your 50%. Done. Imagine you string hips, left and right. See what we're doing? We're taking it down through the body. Push them out now. Push out even further, three, two, and a one and a stop, right leg forwards, heel to the floor, toe to the shin, big breath in, and over we go. Bend that down, guys, I adjust my camera. Something slipped there, don't understand that at all. Right, that's better, good. And we're way down now, way down, two and a one. Recover, bring that back up, other foot coming forwards. Heel to toe, inhale, exhale, and over we go again. Oh, feeling good. This is where the legs are saying to us, we thought you'd forgot about us and missed us out for a change. No. Two and a one. And slowly up we come, hands to the hips, and just take that up and out. Up and out. There. Get the, get the movement going first. Now increase. High knee and a big arc outwards. Big arc outwards. And then you realise, I thought I did that all the time, but I didn't. That's your little cheap brain cell operating. Good, three, two, one, out to in. Up we go, out to in. Sorry, I've got a, a Nordic walking instructor talking to me. Up we go there. Wait, well, there's other thing, he's very much, he's ex-policeman, lives up north, so my God, I've just turned him off. <laughs> okay, isn't modern technology good? Mute. Three, two, and no one. Excellent, swing it upwards, swing it upwards. There, good, gently up and down. Gently up and down. Good. There. And swapping over. There. Good. So in future years, when the hum we have one human and one robot in a relationship, at least for the dominant one, male or female, can mute the other one down. Press the kitchen button, or clean the car button, or move the button. Three, two, and a one, pause, hold, guys. On the toes, and just straight up and down there. Imagine string head, we're going up and down, not rolling forwards. Up and down. There, good. Now, can we go a bit further? Can you feel the heart rate up as well? Heart rate, respiration rate up to have, I don't know, you can call it what you want, carrots or whatever, but cruising if you like. We're in recovery mode at the same time. The body is liking it. Three, two, and a one, pause and a hold. Right, this, it is some of the stuff I'm going to take today, it, yes, it's just for everybody, but we're going to gently jog to the front and back. If there's people watching this later, you can walk and go back, guys, your own level. If there's people in the class right now who've got a bit of a leg muscle this morning or whatever, then you slow down, you find your own level. Here we go. Check nothing around you. Make sure you're nice and safe. And gently jog to the front and the rear again. Good. And the front and the rear. And we're just going to keep this going, guys. All right? Front and rear. There. Because we've got a couple of minutes extra in the class. It's surprising how much it makes, isn't it? How come we can get so much in two minutes? <laughs> We do 38 minutes, 39 minutes, and we ask two minutes, we get even more in. Front and rear. So just let them now drop the arms down there. Deliberately drop them down and shake them out to the side. There. As you go, shake it out. That relaxes you down, keeps you focused. You're on tissue paper. Stay on those toes and keep coming front and rear. Excellent. In my time, I've had people doing different fitness with me, and the first thing that comes out of their mouth is, I don't run, you'll never get me running. Okay, <laughs> then they realise I've got them doing a mile on the spot. Front, guys, and to the rear. So the body's getting going now. We're getting all the juices flowing around the body. It's going to come up. The automatic choke for the adrenaline is getting pulled out. It's going to get pulled back, pushed back in again. And the body's going to use what it needs to. It's not going to waste anything. Hands nice and low. The heart's doing a lot less. It likes that. Good, so let's think of that one and increase the cardiovascular. There, okay, front and rear, good. 
and notice how that changes how the body feels. Your core is going to work differently because of where the hands are to the side, to the front, good, and to the rear. Excellent. Another couple of dozen of those. Relax it back down. Have the hands anywhere where you want to, and I guarantee you'll have your wrists below the heart. We don't want to run hands here. It's got to be downstairs, guys, nice and relaxed. But unless you're sprinting, and the technique there is you're using the arms to power you along to speed you up. Front and rear. Good stuff, like it. To the middle after the next one to the rear. Here we go, there. It's the middle, and just stay on the spot. Just stay on the spot now, nice and light. Nice and light. In we come, 10 second sprint. We ready? And go, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and we return back to the middle. But stay on the toes, stay on the toes. When I used to instruct cardio tennis, you know the biggest tiring thing that people had? They wouldn't let it stand still, they had to stay on the toes. On that one, think our Wimbledon, bring the feet out to the side. We're doing a Cockney Barra, boy, I know. As if you hold imaginary racket, and just now transfer that weight left and right. Just left and right. Now, the toes are on the floor, and just transfer that body weight left and right. Just keep that going, left and right. So on the feet, but the feet are nice and light. Good. Back to the toes again. Cockney Barra boy at Wimbledon. All right? And then normal on the spot. Bring it to the middle. Hands to here. And then left and right. And then left and right. Now, we'll do some extra ones. So while you want to be nice and fast, remember, you've got to get that education thing in and fitness pacing yourself, okay? I honestly believe any of you guys in the class could set off now and walk for 24 hours. You could, all right? Got your fuel stops, you're going to be eating and drinking, but some who step off too quickly will not make it. You've got to find your right pace, and that is into fitness. There we go, left and right. That's why from day one, we've always discussed about 15s and working to your pace. And that way, you increase, you don't burn out. Left and right. All the legs are like in this one, aren't they? There we go, left and right. Good, how many have you done? Eight miles. <laughs> Back to the side, and to the middle, and to there, and on the toes. On the toes, three, two, one, and a nice little stop. Well done, guys. That was a long time, wasn't it, eh? So let's do a combo, change it over, same leg. We've got to... <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> it's like in that movie when, what's it called, Shrek, when he turns into a donkey. All right, here we go, guys. Just the same leg coming forwards. There. Now, go for height. Look how much you're driving now. Use the hands off the balance and kick outwards. There. Good. Fantastic, look at that one. Big dynamic stretch, look at how the arm's coming. Look how balanced you are, that nice straight line of power we've got there. Standing legs, super strong. Remember the days when we, we just did what we did on that first part there, first segment, then stood on one leg and kicked up. We'd all be laid down on the floor. Okay, three, two, and a one. We're gonna change it over, here we go, there. And drive it upwards, I'm using the arm straight away, there. So the arm, you, so I've got my, Right leg coming up, the left arm, if I drive the left arm up, the leg follows. It goes a bit higher. That's your imaginary string. There, drive it out. Keep it coming upwards, guys. Keep it coming up. We're moving all the time. Three, two, and a one, pause, hold. Four arms to here, and nice, paced, gently. Now drive those knees upwards to touch the forearms. If they don't, don't worry, you're going to your maximum. There. Knock in those forearms, get the leaning back feeling. There, fantastic. Three, and two, and one, and pause and hold. Let's get a breath in. Let's, let's do three, shall we? Look, I'm froth at the mouth. Don't zoom in, it's not nice. Take the hands up and out, turn up and go. Exhale down to the heart, squish it out. Turn up, go again. Exhale down to the heart, squish it out. Turn up, go again. Exhale down to the heart, pause, hold, arc the hands down to the side, bring the feet out to your semi sumo, little teapot handle, over we go, guys. So, see what we're doing? We're stretching the muscles out, we're nice and toasty, warm, like little ready breath kids. Over we go, Google it if you don't know the advert. Over we go, over we go, there. And we're bringing the heart rate down, nice recovery. Getting, look how low we're getting on that arm, guys. Two and a one, and bring it up. 
And what we're doing is we're getting to cross section all the stuff we do in the week, one and all is Pilates, everything is mixed together, and we bring it all together. Here we go, other side, breathe in, exhale, all we go, there. All the way over. Little teapot handle, arm down the side of the body. Feeling fantastic. Good. And arm, I'm still tweaking the arm, long arm down the side of the body. Feeling good. Three, two, one. Bring it back up. Hands to the hips and circle the hips around. Circle them around. But look how the body knows it's going to go again. You're not thinking, oh, a cup of tea and slice of cake. That thought has gone, hasn't it? Who's shaking the head? Take it back <laughs> the other way. Depends what type it is. Talk lemon, drizzle, chocolate, brownies, bit of treacle on. Wayne's thinking, nice and warm with some custard on. Rum flavoured. Three, two, and one. Hands to the hips. Push them forwards to the rear. Forwards to the rear. So squeeze those glutes as tight as you can. Tight, relax. Tight, relax. Last one. Tight, relax. String in the hips and left and right. There we go. There. Left and right. Good. You're a runner, you're a walker. You use your feet, guys. You're up and about. You need these hip flexors nice and good. And even for people who are chair bound for whatever the reason, good hip flexors, digestive system helps and that one works upwards, okay? Three, two, and one, and relax. That's where you get your physios with people like that. They do a lot of leg work. And people think they can't use their legs. So what? that's the importance of it, guys. Keeping that circulation going, keeping that return of circulation going. Okay, from there, then, here we go. We're on the spot. We're just to there on the spot, guys, okay? Bring it to the middle, hands to here, left and right. Here we go. It's the first session, and I've got the notes, so I know, don't argue. <laughs> Both faces. It's not big and it's not clever. We've done a session like this. There we go. Round your left and right. We want to get lighter on those toes. That's the first one you're thinking, I can't get any lighter than that. Look at my tissue paper. It's all scrunched up. It's wrapped around my feet. It's horrible. It's not. It's nice and light. I've got new stuff down. Left and right, guys. Left and right. There. And keep going. Now get a bit of a lean left and right when you go. Left and right. Back to the middle and stop. There. Three, two, one. Hold. Right leg forward on the heel. Toe, hands, hip. Normal breathing. Get the stretch in. All the way. Maximum. Hands off the hips. And down I go. Nice and deep. Two, one. I'm going to come upwards. <coughs> get my jogging or running. Long going, other foot forwards, toe to shin, and over a go. Nice and long. Variation of what we've just done. Now keep this going. When you feel the knees lowering down, try and bring them back up again. And then you're working to your own comfortable height. Reset will become guys nice and slowly. All right, shake everything out. <coughs> so think how high your knees can go. Watch your balance. Watch what you've got left and right. Don't end up in a fireplace, all right? If it's lit, get a bucket of water on there now, Tracy, on that log fire, okay? So, on the gentle, there, knees up, okay? Now, drive those knees up now. Drive them up. Good, there. Into the middle. It's left and right. There we go. You're going to do it slower. We want on those toes, guys. Left and right. There. Good, that's it. And get to your own. Now, mind lowered down there. I'm going to try and get them back high again. I want that leaning back feeling at the same time. Now, springiness of the soles of the feet. Plantar fascia. This is fantastic for, okay? Keeping it going. There we go. Return circulation. Springiness in the feet. Elasticity of the muscles. Knees down, love it. Knees upwards, love it. There we go. There. I'm going to go back to the other side once. Back to here once. Then we're in the middle. There. Good. And back over the side. Fantastic. Good. What do we look like? Into the middle, three, two, and a one, and pause and hold. Well done. Hands to the hips. All I want you to do is get those heels off the floor. Mind your string out ahead. Up we go. Now, if you notice what you want to do now, you're thinking, I want to take a big deep breath in. I want to get the arms out. That's your conditioning. Let's hold back for a second, okay? Let's just hold back. Let the body work itself. Keep the heels coming off the floor. Two and one. Feet, semi-sumo, here we go. Hands up and out, turn up, breathe. Exhale down to the heart, good. Hold it there, hold, good. And squish out, turn up, go again. Exhale. 
Okay, now take the hands to the side. Inhale, three seconds, hold. I'll say go. Blow out as hard as you can. That's where my Billy Buffon's coming from. It's you and your breathing exercise. Inhale. One, two, three, go. And take it down. And shake it out. No matter where we are in any exercise, whatever you're doing in life, guys, you know when we get out of breath, the body wants to get rid of the old stuff. That's how the lungs work. That's how the heart rate gets up. Nervous system is told, speed up. Got to get rid of the old stuff. So it's just to inhale and blow out as hard as you can, and you'll feel everything come nicely down. Now it's coming down, right back to the middle. Now, there, we're back there again, just on the toes, just on the toes. This is our high intensity part today. It's on the spot, in here. Some of us are in places, more or less a side, a bit like inside a telephone box, isn't it? You could do this inside a telephone box. And the knees come upwards. Here we go. Now, this is what it is. It's all mind over matter, this is. I don't mind and you don't matter. Okay, so here we go. To the front, there. Like little baby gazelles, aren't we? And then to the rear. This is our Bambi. To the front, now you decide how far to the front you come, then how far to the rear. Watch you don't take off accelerating. When you're doing high knees and you go backwards, you can go a little bit too fast and a bit of a stumble can take in. But on the toes, good, and back again. Fantastic. Another 25 of those. There, and back. Good. One more at the front. There, good. Out, and to the rear. Good. And to the middle. And stop again. semi sumo bring the feet out to there. Okay, hands to here. Nice and slow. Squat down there. There, good. Fantastic. Now we come back up again. Turn the hands up, breathe in. Exhale to the heart. Squish it out. Palms down. Push again. Down we go there. Good. And back up. Turn the hands up, breathe in. When we're done this morning, guys, we are done. This isn't aiming at, is he going to do 50? Push it back down. As the screens go blank. <laughs> all right. And bring it back up again. I know if I said this is, you'd all be there. Well done. Exhale down. Good. Squish it out. Down we go again. There. Good. We're bringing in lots of different moves, lots of different expertise that we have. Turn up and breathe. And exhale back down again. And back out. Look at the mental focus. You get you recharge your mental strength as well. Bring it back up. You're pushing really hard. Turn the hands up. Breathe. Keep this going. Exhale down. And then you put this in. You're conditioning the brain. So you, so you could do. Let's say you're doing that long walk, that long run, that long workout. Whatever you're doing, you can carry on the body, getting the body working. You can think about good things in life. Down we go. That's why I always say, don't try and the brain out. Bring it back up. When you bring up good things in life, you're recharging your nervous system and the brain, the focus, concentration. There we go, last one, dipping it down. There. And we come back up. And we turn the hands up and breathe in. And then we exhale and come down. We hold it there. Arc the hands there, lock the thumb out. Rotate those shoulders to the front. And then to the rear. Well done, guys. No, we're not going to get back on the toes. Not yet, okay? We're going to... A little bit of break because it says so on my list over there, which I wrote down this morning. All right, so bring the feet out. Just pass what you hit with this. Knees just off lock. Let's bring some isometrics in for power and strength of the body, shall we? Hands up and out. Bring the palms together. Get the elbows up. 100%. All you guys on screen, 100%, and all the press and plays later. Here we go. 80% as you know because I've told you. Ready? Push in. Go. In. There. And keep the pushing going, guys. Now, push that in. Is it 100%? We don't know. We'll try and push harder. Fingertip to palm of the hand. Keep it going. Is it 10 seconds? No, because we've passed 10 seconds. Keep it going. Keep it going for three and two and one. Release, arc it down and shake everything out. Get back in your good habits. Walk it around. Rub the wrists. Give them a good shake. Liking it. Okay. I'm liking this nail clip session, guys. We might have some more of these ones. Okay, bring the feet back out, get reset, scratch the lottery leg. Okay, hook the hands over, we're here. Ready? Go, and pull, there. It never ceases to amaze you guys how strong these fingers are, isn't it? You can look at the muscles trying to open up that grip and it's not letting it happen. 
Keep pulling, keep pulling, keep pulling. We're going past the 10 seconds. Increase, 100%, 100%. Sweating, glowing, ready, Brett, kids. Three, two, one, and arc that back down. Give it a good shake out. Tommy Cooper, those shoulders, rotate them around. Give the hand a nice, gentle shake out. In steps, coming together to here. Okay, what? My right leg's itching like mad. I've got to go online. You might be instructed by a millionaire, Rodney. <laughs> okay, hands to the thighs. We're going to wind this one up. So think on toilet, off, on, off, there, and back. And as I speed it up, you're going to your speed. If you can stay with me, fantastic. If you go any faster, I'm well, fine. <laughs> Notice my voice, I'm fine. You want to show off, you just show off. There, good. Here we go then, I'm slowly winding that up, but don't get let the brain cell cheat one work. Take the butt down. Now as you speed up, you might not be getting that full depth. In that case, you slow down slightly, get the full depth, and then increase. And keep that going. We would have stopped in days of old. Keep it going, guys. Big exercise, big exercise. To finish it off, hands to the side. Feel it up into the base of the skull working hard. You've not even thought about your balance. Looking good, straight line. Three, two, one, and down, and a shake out. Shake it like guys, walk it about. I believe it's three breaths, turn up, out, turn up, go. Exhale down. Out, turn up, go. Exhale down. Out, up, turn up. Exhale down. And arc it down. Fantastic. Feet, normal width. God's little template with the hands. Hip width apart. Same thing, more or less. Hands to thighs. And we're there. And there. Now, feel when you stand up now. Those glutes are engaging. You can feel it. Your abs are going to work. And you feel the core muscles working. As soon as you move in everyday life, even a fraction, your core is ready to engage. There. Looking good. Fantastic, guys. You have all changed your lives over the past, what, since we started the classes? Everyone. Everyone has, guys. Looking good. Ready? Hands to the side. And there. And there. Looking fantastic. There. For three. And two. And one. And we're back down. And we feel that in a bit. Roll up into here. Feel that one? Oh, lock the thumb out. Let's rotate them forwards. We don't have tension in the upper body. Tommy Cooper, the shoulders, rotate to the rear. Circle the head at the same time if you can. Okay, we're not too much of tie ourselves or not. Two, one, let's get the three breaths. Hands up and out, turn up, go. Exhale down. Out we go, turn up. Exhale down. Out we go, turn up. Exhale down. Arc it down, good habits, whatever your good habit is. Finger in the ear, scratch it, all that sort of stuff. That resets you and brings you down. Watch sportsmen, no matter what they do. All right, watch them. We do, Tuck. Stop nagging. <laughs> Bring the feet out, guys, to what you consider to be your semi-sumo. Hands to the thighs. Ready? Now, this one you can dip nice and we we'll start off super slow with this one so we can get that depth. If you start off too fast, you won't get your maximum depth because you're thinking... I want to get competition takes over. I want to get back nice and tall again. Down we go there. Good. And then I feel that. Lots of stuff going on. Lots of good stuff. There's a huge stretch going on. Tiny bit of isometrics, maybe. Joint healthier joints. Origins insertions. Capital B for balance and posture. Breaks coming off now. Here we go. There and back. I'm keeping that depth on, guys. There. Nice gentle increase. Keeping the depth on. We can get nice and super low because the knees are separated, feet separated, the joints being looked after. But you're going to your own depth, remember. No matter if it's two or three inches, you've got an injury, or full depth because you're feeling really good, like an elastic band. Little sprint coming up, five seconds, go. One, two, three, four, five. Hands to the side, five, four, three, two, one, and there, and switch those feet in. Now shake it out, the legs need it. We're burning lots of calories, or what? 
What's going on? Good. All right. Stand how you feel happy. All right. I'm standing with my feet on the ground, but I'm on a seat till I'm nice and happy. Hands up and out. Five second hold. Breathe in, go. Go. Oh, keep down there. It's a good thing that when you get out of breath, you're thinking, he wants us to hold our breath and I'm out of breath. Feel the effect, feel it. One more of those, up, out, inhale. Go. Yes, I like it, okay. Right, believe it or not, here we go. Walk to the front and back. Brisk walk, okay, there. Brisk walking is important, you know why? Because we don't practice it. Some people have a speed, and whatever their speed, that's their walking speed. Some people will go out now, they'll be on a five mile walk. It's doing nothing for them, it's gonna take them three hours, right? And they do that walk every day. Fantastic, they're going, they have mental wellness and everything else, but they're not gonna improve their fitness. That's all I meant by not doing anything for them. So a brisk walking, guys, front and rear. Right, increase that walk, there, and to the rear, there. Without running, as walking as fast as you can, front, and to the rear. Feel what's going on with the body, there. You can feel the acceleration and deceleration. You can put the brakes on, we're running, a lot of muscles take over. You've got to be more focused. It's like the difference between being artist and being fit, front and rear. You've probably taken smaller steps, there, and out and back. The knees are certainly not coming off the ground, but it's a good, we need to practice fast and brisk walking. So we get the feet off the ground, there, and back. So we're in control all the way. Last one to the front, last one to the rear, and we're in the middle, and we're just on the toes. Just bring the knees up, the toes come off the floor. Similar thing left and right. Walking left and right, hands to here, and start walking, guys. Left, and then to your right. Now just think knees, don't think feet. Get the knees up, the feet will fall. If they don't, you've got a very serious problem. All right, and <laughs> to the side, I hear you're walking on stumps. Now we go there, and keep that going. Now can we speed that up? Notice when we run doing this one, it's far easier, isn't it? When we're doing it, thinking of a walking sideways and walking fast, oh, what's the, what are the legs doing? There, left and right, looking good. Last one this side, last one this side coming up. Fantastic, back to the middle, and just on the spot now. Three, two, one, pause and stop. Feet God's template and just push those knees and hips forward. Toes are on the floor. Now, push, push, push. Now, we normally have left foot forward and right hand. Whichever hip's coming forward, I want that arm to come forward. Ready? There, there, like a train. And then let the, want the knee and hip to fall. Push forward, guys. Relax it down, let those knees bend. There, there. Three, two, and a one. Transfer opposite hand and opposite legs. Where we started before, ready? Just raise it up, there, and back, and up. Same arm, same leg, drive it out. So we're upsetting the balance, if you like, and getting a twist going. Good. Three, two, one, pause, high knees, high knees. Now get the knees going up, left and right. Now opposite arms. So gonna have it to there, and you drive up, gonna come out, there. Opposite arm, there. So the hips are going one way, shoulders the other. Feel the difference now, when we very first started. We're gonna have a little bit of fun to finish off. This hasn't been fun, or it has, you're gonna have belly ache after the next one. Three, two, <laughs> two, one. Okay, there's somebody hidden in behind you, they're gonna run out and punch you in the belly and check out if you're cool. Okay, just my camera guys, I'm gonna just yours. Right, I want you to go up to your furthest point to the rear you can do from the camera, and I want you to sit down on the floor. Good, all right. When I say go, up, get to your furthest point to the front, 10 squats, then back to here and sit back down again. Are we ready? Go, up we come, there, to the front, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and back again, there, yes, and we're sitting down. Racking, good, so can we do it faster? I don't, yes we can, we can. Right, who's like this? He can't see me on the camera, I'm here ready. 
All right. Somebody's camera's pointing at the ceiling. All right. Three, three, wait for it. Go. Up we come. There. Front. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And back again. Yes. And the bum. That's good stuff. Trace is happy. She's sitting on a duster and she's polishing the floor at the same time. Oh, somebody's gone past some one of those remote control hoovers. Good idea. Right, lie down flat on the back. Oh, wait till we get to the headstand. On the back then. I know what you're doing. Looking at the camera, you can't see us. <laughs> Ready? Go! Oh, we're coming. Standing. Into the camera. Oh, wobble. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And to the rear. And lay down again. And we're there. Yes. Oh. Oh. I need a cup of tea and some toast, peeps. All right, so I'll put that one in. <laughs> On the stomach, guys. Yes. You knew it was coming. On the stomach. Forearms on the floor. Nose on the carpet or whatever, feet on the floor. Ready? Go up there. Sprint in. And or oh, beat you. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And back again. And we're down the floor. Yes. Good. Because I know the little tip for that one. Come up from your front. Do a quick burpee, guys. You get massive, all right? Mind the lights. Because I've said that, you've got a bonus. Ready, same position, same thing again. Go up there and in. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and back again. And on the stomach, and we're there. Oh, talking of burpees, how can we not do any of them? <laughs> it's okay, guys, calm down. All right, from there. On your left side, oh, left side. That's not your left side, the other one. Ready? Go up there, in. One left after this, one, two, three, four, five. We're a blur, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And back in, and on the left side. We're looking like a, like a washing machine on a super spin. That's what we want. On your other side then. What side's that? I don't know. I've lost count. Your other side. There. Good. My carpet damp or I'm sweating that much. Ready. Ready. Wait for it. Go. Up we come. There. In the front. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. Walk it back, guys. Looking good. And shake it out. Keep walking it around, shake it out. You know what? I actually remembered to bring in the yellow bottle, but today I forgot to drink from it. <laughs> well, one day I'll be here till I get it right. All right, guys, hands up in that palms facing me, left and right. Around we go, looking good. We haven't got to rush through. That was fantastic. Really enjoying the extra couple of minutes, big time. Pause and hold there, turn hands up, breathe in. Exhale, keep the hands high, push up towards the ceiling. Keep pushing up, normal breathing, keep pushing up, keep pushing up. And bring the hands back down, there, to the side. Lean over left or right, any side you want to. No teapot handles. Over we go. Nicely back up over the other side. Over we go. Look how fast you're recovering. See that? We could do that all again if we had to. We have to. <laughs> bring it back up nice and slowly. Hands and hips, circle hips around. Circle the trend. Now, don't just go away from your fantastic day. Go away from your fantastic and a safe day. And the other thing is, be proud of yourselves, right? That was really good. Anybody here could walk into any gym class and do a high level, whatever they're doing. It's that from me. Well done, guys. Three, two, one, pause, hold. Hip thrust to the front and the rear. Squeeze those glutes. Find the midpoint, pause. Right foot forward to the heel, toes. Inhale. Exhale all the way down. Oh, I can smell toast. <laughs> there we go. The message was transmitted and received. All right. <laughs> Slowly up we come. There. 
and other foot forwards, right? And down we go, guys. Good. Fantastic, amazing, loved it. What a start to the week. Be proud, press your little button if you need to, recover from there, bring it in. Before the clap, group hug. There. Yes, we like that one. Good. Back to here. One, two, three, go. Yes. Brilliant. Ah, oh, sorted. Good. Catch you all later. All oh, glowing faces and everything like it. Well done, guys. Okay, custard and sprinkles after that. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, we'll be there, Same on the morning. We'll let some of you all pointing my way. When <laughs> <we're> <laughs> <all right. laughs> Have a great day.